It all started with us, the cavemen. Since day one, our people have always been where the action is. Sure, maybe not front and center, but if you're enjoying your modern civilization, you might want to send us a little thank you now. We're not that hard to find. We're right here beside you. We're really not that different from you. Just a little better looking. That handsome boy. Don't say one word. Don't even look in my general direction. Andy, will you get my camera, please? I want to take a picture for the fridge. What's going on, Nick? Due to certain financial hardships, I've been forced to take a job as a <clears throat> substitute school teacher. Oh. Because I thought maybe you were a Mormon. He knows that taunting me about this may result in a stab one, right? No, I'm not taunting you. I'm actually looking for a job myself. I'm working on my resume right now. Here, look. Wow, accounting. Uh-huh. Take this back, it's making me sad. Did you see my special skills? I bet you didn't know I was a drum major, huh? You just get cooler every second. Can you open the door? Not till you finish your granola bar. You're not serious. No, I just had the car cleaned. See, this is why I hate bombing rides off of you, because it's never just a ride. It's about control, rules, cleanliness, structure. It's like getting a ride in a prison bus. Fine. Feel free to take a bus. But until then, you're not eating in my car. <coughs> oh, do you have any milk? I'm never driving you anywhere again. Why are you so cranky? Look at that guy. 50 cc's under him, open road, goes wherever he wants. Well, just keep working hard and maybe one day you can have one of those too. Hey, you're gonna wrinkle your tie. It's yours. All right, people, my name is Mr. Hedge. I can tell by your wide-eyed stares and slackened jaws that you've never been taught by a caveman before. So let's go through the basics, shall we? Do I live in a cave? No. I live in a sweet-ass condo. Do I hunt and kill my own food? No. I shop in an organic grocery store and pay too much for heirloom tomatoes. Do I paint animals on walls? On occasion, when I'm drunk enough. Any more questions? Hannah Montana. Do you have a tail? Yes and it's got a poisonous barb on it, so don't mess with me. Now, I'm here for the week, unless Mr. Jenkins' prostate turns out to be the big C. So let's just get through this, all right? So where are we? Page 86, the war to end all wars. All right, you, ironic t-shirt, read. World War I was caused by the assassination of the Archduke Franz Ferdinand. Oh, what an adorably simple explanation for one of the darkest moments in human history. Let me tell you something about World War I. The big countries pimped out the small countries like skeezy little hookers. Skeezy little hookers. That's not in the book. Textbooks are a crock. Why should you care what Mr. Joanne Gernsley thinks, all right? Think for yourselves. Question authority. Okay, clearly you people are in need of some enlightenment. So set your alarm clocks for now. It's wake up time. Ding dong! Hello? Hi, Joel. I'm looking for your brother, Andred. Oh, no, I'm, I'm Andy. Stop it. No, I, I am. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. You two look but exactly alike. Well, we get that a lot. I bet. From you. Well, I'm Leslie. I'm Kate's mom. I manage this property. Nice to meet you. Yeah, no, we've met. Anywho, no. I found your resume in the copy machine in the rec room. You're an accountant? Yeah. Well, son, today is your lucky day. It just so happens that I'm in need of a little number crunching. Are you good with balancing the books? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm an accountant. Perfect. I'll pay you. Okay. Under the table, of course. Oops, I guess I shouldn't say that to my accountant. Probably not. Okay, come on, let's go. Now? Yeah. Come on, boy. Come on. <laughs> Did you just whistle at me? 
So, why does the water from your tap have that funny aftertaste? The minerals in the pipes? Wrong. If the free water piped into your home tasted good, why would you ever pay for plastic bottles of water supposedly trucked in from some pristine stream in some made-up magical mountain? So it's the bottled water lobbyist. No, think big picture. Who benefits from all this trucking? Big oil. Bam. So what are we supposed to drink? Exactly. Guys, why aren't you writing this down? In five years, they're going to be making a movie about it, okay? And I'll be played by, like, Zac Efron. Well, it's because you're such a hoe bag. Okay, fine, slut, whatever. Well, what's the difference? Oh. Oh, stop. Good God, woman. Have some cooth. Yeah, I got to go now. What? Mama? Oh. Skank. So how is my little accountant doing? I'm a little confused, actually. You know, it's funny, it looks like you're trying to funnel money from your husband's account into a dummy corporation. Yes. But that's illegal. Uh-huh. Which means not legal. And that's why it's going to be our little secret. I can't do this. Come on, Andy, it's not like I'm trying to rip off the government. But you... It's just... I have a special friend, and I would like my special friend to have a nice condo, and for reasons that are too complicated to explain, I would like my husband to remain blissfully ignorant. Yeah, Leslie, I'm sorry, I'm just not comfortable with this. Please. But, oh, but, but. Oh, come on. Look, you, you, you can, can do it. No. Come on, just do it. No, look, no, you, 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 you just can't. do it. Hi. Mm. I need your help, Andy, because I'm just a woman and I'm confounded by numbers. And when I saw your resume, I just knew that you were my knight in shining armor because you're not only an accountant, you're also a drum major. Here we go, Andy. Here we go. Here we go, Andy. Here we go. Yogurt. Man, I can't believe how hungry I am. You work up quite an appetite molding young minds, huh? I believe that's my yogurt. You know what I believe? I believe I've been too cynical for too long. To be honest, just took this job for the money, but being in there with those kids today just got me really fired up. It has my name on it. Cindy? I mean, having a room full of impressionable minds hanging on your every word, what a rush! He's still eating it. I mean, what am I telling you for? You guys are in the trenches day in, day out, fighting the good fight. A fight for a better tomorrow. That was totally my sandwich. Those people are always hungry. What's up, Superstar? Hey, Mr. Hedge. 